Hello traders, today's top stories. Global markets will see full volume today as investors return from their long holiday weekend and Wall Street will be in focus. It's Tuesday, April the 18th and here is our New York Review. Wall Street turned in solid gains on Monday as some traders returned from their long holiday weekend to participate in the markets. However, investors will be fully in their offices today and large volumes are likely to be experienced for the first time on U.S. exchanges since Wednesday of last week. Retail sales numbers on Friday from the states proved lackluster and the outcome may make for a speculative U.S. dollar today and tomorrow as traders gauge its recent weakness. Building permits data will be published today as housing sector figures start to be released. Monday's gross domestic product results from China were solid and the industrial production numbers from the nation beat expectations handily. The Asian equity markets turned in a cautiously optimistic day of trading today with gains seen in Japan and for the Shanghai Shenzhen Composite in China. The Nikkei and Topics positive sessions today helped the yen to sell off slightly against the US dollar, reversing the strength seen the past week for the Japanese currency. European and UK economic data will be minimal today following the long holiday weekend. European equities, which have been cautious, have opened with some positive trading early today. The euro and pound have both done well against the US dollar in recent trading and remain near important resistance levels. Bank of England Governor Mark Carney will be speaking in the US later this week and will get the attention of FTSE and pound traders. Gold has remained volatile in early trading today as it saw a sell-off when the Asian markets opened. However, the precious metal remains within the higher realms of its range and investors will likely remain speculative in the coming days as full trading re-emerges. Traders will pay attention to the building permits numbers which will be published at 12.30 p.m. GMT in the States. Thank you all for watching, have a great trading day and we will see you again soon.